Hi, I'm Dr. Andrew Davis, the Application Scientist here at SpecHack. Welcome to the Newton Demo Lab. Today, we're going to be talking about the DC-3, the diamond compression cell. So what is the DC-3 and what problems does this solve in IR microscopy? Well, to demonstrate the benefits, we will first show an uncompressed sample. As you can see, poor signal is observed through the uncompressed sample. To use the DC-3, the sample is placed over the crystal. The top is then mounted and the thumb screws are used to crush the sample. The samples that remain compressed after the load is removed, best practice is to dismantle the cell. Then analyse the two windows to see which one has the sample on. This is the slide that we will take to the microscope. When compressed, the sample spreads out, completely filling the microscope aperture. A good spectrum is then observed. So what is a current novel IR microscopy challenge? Well, microplastics are a growing environmental concern and their identification is an essential first step in their eradication. In order to simulate the sea, and make microplastics, we stirred a vial of water with different plastics and grit for a week at 60 degrees. The artificial sea was then filtered through filter paper. In true Blue Peter fashion, here's one we made earlier. Different samples were mounted on a DC-3 and measured under the FTIR microscope. A simple library match was then used to determine their identity. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.